If you're a plant manager, quarry manager, port manager, if you're simply managing heavy off-the-road equipment, the last thing you need are tie-related issues. Be damage or punctures, especially on a regular basis. Machine downtime, safety implications, wasted labour and the cost of call-outs and repair are all symptoms of tie-related issues. If this is happening to you already, you will be frustrated and annoyed, especially if you're the person responsible for the smooth operation of these machines. So if you want to know more about tyres can be repaired safely, reliably and cost-effectively, keep on watching the video. Plus, I'm going to tell you about a type of repair that's happening more and more frequently because it's quick and it's cheap, but trust me, will result in greater cost to your business. I'm Derek Adams, Operations Director for T&C Site Services. Before we talk about permanent repairs, let's talk about something that we see here at T&C on a regular basis. And it's something that's confused with a permanent solution. Plugs. Plugging is where rubber string is inserted into a hole in the hope that it's going to seal the hole and prevent air loss. It doesn't seal the hole. It doesn't prevent air loss. It's not a permanent solution and it's not a repair. It's a little bit like filling a hole in your tooth with chewing gum and expecting that to last forever. It's not a permanent solution and never will be. So what are the options for permanent repairs? And the first we're going to talk about is a minor repair. A well, minor repair is suitable for minor damage to the tyre. It can be completed on site. The tyre is removed in order that we can inspect the tyre to make sure that the tyre is suitable for the minor repair to be completed. The tyre is prepped in order that we can fit a minor repair patch. This patch seals the damage and creates a permanent and reliable repair. When plugging a tyre, we don't have to remove it. This creates a problem. We cannot see any damage inside the tyre and we often see that there's greater damage inside than outside. When a tyre receives major damage, such as splits in the sidewall or penetrations to the tread, it will require vulcanisation. Vulcanisation, in this case, is heat and pressure applied to the tyre. This cannot be completed on site. It cannot be completed on site because of the specialist equipment and the controlled environment required. A vulcanised repair will help to maintain the structural integrity of the tyre for the rest of its life. The fact that it will run for the rest of its life makes it a very cost-effective option. It also helps the environment in that the only other option with the tyre, if it can't be repaired, is for it to be disposed of. Thank you for watching this video. If you'd like some more useful, helpful information, please visit our website www.tcsiteservices.co.uk. See you again soon.